subscapers and welcome to Darkness of Hallow Vale quest guide. The requirements are to be on the regular spellbook. The quest requirements are in aid of the marquee. Fairy Tale Part 2 or 3 is recommended to be able to use the fairy rings. The skill requirements are 5 construction, 20 mining, 22 thieving, 26 agility, 32 crafting, 33 magic and 40 strength. The item requirements are 8 steel nails or any other, but not rune nails. 2 planks that are regular, proteans do not work. 1 air and law rune, they are obtainable during the quest as well. A knife in your tool belt works as well. Super energy potion if your acidity level is low. And 6 free inventory slots. The recommended items are a Draymon staff if you have only completed Fairy Tale Part 2. If you have done part 3, the Draymond staff is not needed. The recommended unlocks are fairy rings, lodestones to Yanil, Kenifis and Farok, and have some quick teleport charges from using Miswax to speed things up. Let's go! To start off, use the lodestone to Yanil. We will be using the fairy rings to Mauritania Swamp. If you don't have the fairy rings unlocked, you can also use the lodestone to Canifis, go southwest through the gate and make your way to the fairy ring to the southeast. The fairy ring code is BKR. When you get near the fairy ring at the swamp, go southeast towards the boat. Go towards the travel icon, click on the boat to travel. Go southwest. Go south from the bridge and jump over the fence. Go south to the pub, open the door and jump over the broken wall. Climb down the ladder. Talk to Veliav. Option 4 and accept the quest. Option 1. 2. 3 4 5 Climb up the stairs Jump over the broken wall Go southeast We will fix a boat It is on the quest icon Click on the boat to search it. And then use a plank from your inventory to the boat to fix it. South of the boat, use a plank from your inventory to the boat chute to fix it. Click on the boat to push it down the chute. Go down the docks and click on the boat to board it. To see better in this place, go to your graphic settings, turn up your brightness, lightning detail to medium, and turn off shadows.
and right-clicking the world map, skybox and filters, and using the midday so you can see better. This place is otherwise very dark. Climb across the rocks to your north, to your west, climb over the rocks. Keep going to northwest. Kick down the floor and climb down. Climb the wall rubble to your northeast. Talk to Meyer Dietz Citizen. Option 4. 4. 4. If you get interrupted by wire watches during this quest, you can use the freedom ability to escape. You can also select the first option and you will lose a little bit of HP. Go north to the achievement icon on the minimap. Talk to old man Ral. Option 4. Option 4. Southwest of the same NPC, climb up the ladder. Jump south to the floorboards. Jump east to the floorboards. Go to the northeastern corner of this room, push the wall, and walk across the gap. Crawl under the wall to the north. Go north to the second room, look to your west and push the wall. Go across. Climb down the ladder. Next to the wall you will see a table, search it. Open the trapdoor and go underneath it. Climb up the shelf to your northwest. To your east, crawl under the wall. To your east, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the ladder. To your east, search the pots near the door. You will get a key. Use the key to the door and open the door. Go east and climb up the ladder. To your south, jump over the floorboards. Go northeast, south, and to your southwest, climb up the shelves. To your west, climb up the ladder. To your south, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the ladder. To your east, go across the washing line. Climb down the ladder. To your north, push the wall. Walk across the floor. Go north and climb up the shelf. To your northeast, climb down the shelf. To your northwest, jump over the floorboards. 
VR North, jump over the floorboards. Go north, around the gap, and in the northeastern corner, jump over the floorboards. To your east, climb up the ladder. Go west and search the wall. You will get a topmost part of a ladder. To your east, climb down the ladder. Right next to you, there's a broken ladder, so use the part of a ladder from your inventory to the ladder near you. Climb down the ladder, open the door and go north. Go into the house with a chimney or unlit fireplace in it. Go west through the door to the next room, go north, go east and go into the house which has a ladder in it. Climb up the ladder. To your east, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the stairs. Go south, push the wall. Select knife. Push the wall. Push the decorated wall. Click on the lumpy rock, climb down the trapdoor and enter it, go north, talk to Vertida, option 3, Option 4. Use the lowstone to Yanil. We will be using the fairy rings. We are heading back to Veliav, which is in the basement of pub in Berg de Rot. And you can also use the lowstone to Canifis, go southwest through the gate and make your way to the fairy ring to the southeast. The fairy ring code is BKR. When you get near the ferry ring, go southeast and we will be using the boat. Go towards the travel icon. Click on the boat to travel. Go southwest. Go south from the bridge and jump over the fence. Go south to the pub. Open the door, jump over the broken wall and climb down the ladder. Talk to Veliav. Option 1. Option 3. Option 4. Use the lost onto Kennevis. Run west. Go through the door to Mausoleum. Talk to Dressel. Option 2. Option 5. Talk to Dressel again. Option 1. And you will get the Temple Library Key. 
option 5. Talk to Drizzle. Option 2. Option 5. You can drop the Wolfbane Dagger. Go west through the gate. Keep going to west. Go to the northwestern corner, go through the door and climb up the ladder. Go southwest and stop at the church steps. You will see some small bushes. Search them. You should get a cinematic. Go north and slightly east, back to Mausoleum. Go east, through the doors, back to Dressel. Talk to Drizzle, option 1. He will give you some runes to teleport to Varok. You can destroy the Wolfbane Dagger. Use the Varok teleport from your spellbook or the Varok lodestone. Go north to the castle. We will be talking to King Rold. To your east, talk to King Rold. Option 1. Option 4. Option 1. Go east and talk to Trezel. Option 2. Option 3. Use the low stone to Yanil. We will be heading to Veliav who is located in Bergderot. If you don't have the fairy rings unlocked, you can also use the lowstone to Canifis, go southwest through the gate and make your way to the fairy ring to the southeast. The fairy ring code is BKR. When you get near the fairy ring, go southeast and use the boat. Go southwest and jump over the fence to your south. Go south to the pub, open the door and climb over the broken wall. Climb down the trap door. Talk to Veliav. Option 1. Option 2. Option 3. Option 4. Climb up the ladder. Jump over the broken wall. 
go southeast and we will be using the boat to Meyer Ditz. Jump to the rocks, climb up the rocks, go northwest and climb down the ladder. Go north and climb over the wall to your east. Now we want to get caught by the wire watches and when you get caught it is option 2, send me to the mines. Now there's actually a trick to get the wire watches to notice you. It is to hop worlds, so if it takes more than one minute, you can try hopping to a different world. So when you get caught, option two. On the walls, you will see light blue ore, mine those, until you have 15. It stacks nowadays, so you don't have to worry about your inventory space. So just to recap, mine 15. When you get 15 or use them to a nearby minecart. Option 1, talk to Juvenite Guard. Here's the location we will head to next. Go south. The correct house should have door north and south of it. Go through the doors to south and climb up the ladder. To your east, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the ladder. Go south, click on the wall. Click on the sickle wall, click on the trapdoor on the rock, and climb down. Go north and talk to Vertida. Option 3. Option 2. Climb down the ladder. Open the door. Go south and climb up the wall rubble to your southwest. Go south and climb up the stairs. Keep going to north. Before the gap, climb down the ladder. 
to your east, right click the rocky surface and search it. To your north, click on the barricade. Go north. Climb up the ladder. Go north. If you get seen by Firebots, option 1. Climb up the ladder to your north. To your north, climb down the ladder. Keep going to north. Climb up the ladder to your north. Go north. Talk to Cephalon. Option 2. Option 1. Option 3. Go west and follow the path. Go north and follow the path. Follow the path to east. Here's the first marking. Use a charcoal to a papyrus while standing next to the sickle marking. We need to do this three times in different locations. Follow the path to west. Follow the path to south. You will see the second marking. Go next to it. Use the charcoal to a papyrus. Follow the path to east. And there will be the last marking. Go next to it, use a charcoal to a papyrus, and this will start a cinematic and a fight. You cannot win this one, you just have to tank for a while, and you will get knocked out. This is totally safe. Go west, back to the marking on the floor, use the charcoal to the papyrus, and this will finish the sketch. Go south and climb down the ladder. It's on the edge of the wall. Go south, we are making our way back to Safalan.
climb up the ladder, go south and climb down the ladder, go south, before the gap you will see a ladder to your east, climb down, go south, open the barricade wall, climb up the ladder, go south, climb down the ladder to your south, to your north, climb over the wall rubble, Go near the wire watches and try to get seen. It is the option 2, send me to the mines. And world hopping helps with the aggro. There we go. Option 2, set me to the mines. This is the fastest way that we can use to get to the next location. Mine 15 ore from the walls. Use the ore to the minecart and talk to a juvenile guard. Option 1. Now we need to head to the next building on the minimap I have marked. Go south. You will see a house with a door to its north and south. Go through the doors and climb up the ladder to south. To your east, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the stairs. To your south, click on the wall. Click on the decorated wall with the sickle icon. Click on the rock to open a trapdoor and climb down. Go north, talk to Cephalon, option 1, option 4, option 5, go south, Climb up the ladder. To your north, push the wall. Climb up the stairs. To your west, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the ladder. Go west. 
south, go through the door to the house with the fireplace, click on the fireplace to look at it, choose the knife option and you will get a message in your inventory. Read the message from top to bottom, to your south, search a portrait, choose knife, search the portrait again, and you will get a key. Go northeast, climb up the ladder, go east, jump over the floorboards, climb down the ladder, to your south, push the wall, push the decorated wall with the sickle, climb down the rock trapdoor, and climb down. Go north and talk to Safalan. Option 2. If you don't have the large ornate key in your inventory, you have to retrieve another one. Go south and climb up the ladder. Push the wall to your north. Climb up the stairs. To your west, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the ladder. Go north and try to stay close to the eastern wall. Keep going to north. You will see a house with a yellow rug on the northern wall or tapestry. Head over there. Click on the tapestry and select knife. Go through it. From your inventory, use the key to the statue in the southeastern corner. It will open the door to the east. Go through the door to the east. Climb down the staircase. Now we need to use a telekinetic crab spell from the magic book. You can search the northwestern broken case for runes. From the middle of this room, look to your west and there is the high alchemy wall 1. Use the telekinetic crab spell to that. To your northeast, climb over the stairs. Go through the door, go through the tapestry, and keep going to south. We are returning to the hideout. It is the room which has a door to its north and south. Go through the doors to south and climb over the ladder. To your east, jump over the floorboards. Climb down the stairs. To your south, push the wall. Click on the sickle wall. Climb down the rug trapdoor and click on it to climb down. Go north and talk to Safalan. You need two free inventory shots. Make sure you get a sealed message and a shortcut key. You can add the key to your keyring if you have done one small favor.
you still owe stone to Yanil. We are almost done. If you don't have the fairy rings unlocked, you can also use the lowstone to Canifis, go southwest through the gate and make your way to the fairy ring to the southeast. The fairy ring code is BKR. Go southeast and click on the boat to travel. Go southwest and climb over the fence. Go south to the pub, open the door and climb over the broken wall. Climb down the trap door. Talk to Veliav. Option bun. Congratulations. Read the tome and use it to a skill to get 2000 experience three times. The skill must be over level 30. Right click all of the keys in your inventory and add them to your keyring if you have completed one small favor. You can get rid of the temple library key, the message and Wolfbane. Remember to leave a like, comment and subscribe and see you in the next one.